chemosaturation really is at the very start of what we think it can do. The results are very, very encouraging. What we're seeing is that the results are far better than traditional chemotherapies that are given through the vein. The chemosaturation is a way of delivering very high doses of chemotherapy directly to the liver. And what's special and new about chemosaturation is the blood from the liver is taken out of the body and passed through a specialist filter which extracts the chemotherapy before the blood's returned to the body. So the dose to the system is much less, but the dose to the liver, where the tumours are, is many, many times higher. And that's the beauty of chemotherapy saturation of the liver. A lot of the problems with chemotherapy is the side effects to the body, um, which chemosaturation therapy minimises because it's just targeted to the liver. You need staff there who are familiar with bypass procedures, perfusionists, nurses, the doctors themselves, the anaesthetists. And um, I think that's why the Harley Street Clinic is very strong in delivering this service. There are some tumours which seem to go to the liver predominantly. One of them is uh, melanoma from the eye. In approximately 70 or 80 percent of patients, those patients only get secondaries in the liver. High dose chemotherapy saturation of the liver is extremely effective and a large percentage of those patients will get into remission with the tumour shrinking and going dormant because of this procedure. I would hope that in 10 years from now, chemotherapy saturation of the liver would be a standard treatment as part of a patient's pathway if liver cancer is their main problem. <laughs>